Type 1 diabetes, in a quick explanation, is an autoimmune disease. That means your immune system turns around and attacks itself. In type 1 diabetes, it attacks the pancreas. The pancreas is where insulin is made, and I'll explain that later. So, your immune system's defenses sit outside your pancreas and kill the insulin coming out until there's none going on anymore. Okay, that's the immune system's part. Now, insulin, the stuff that comes out of your pancreas, is a hormone. In a normal person, the insulin travels in your bloodstream, and it helps your cells to eat because insulin is a key to unlocking your cells for sugar, the food. Diabetics have to keep track of how many carbs they eat because carbs turn into sugar. Your doctor can tell you have type 1 or type 2 diabetes because your blood sugar, or the amount of sugar in your blood, rises due to insulin not letting it get into your cells. So without insulin, sugar just kind of floats around in your blood. Your doctor can do a blood draw to test your blood sugar level, or he can also take a ketone sample, which is the amount of sugar in your urine. If you are diagnosed with type 1 or type 2 diabetes, you have to get your blood sugar under control. To get your blood sugar under control, you have to take insulin from shots like me, or you can have an insulin pump, which automatically pumps insulin into you. With an insulin pump, you, can only, you only have to refill it or take a shot every three to four days. I also have to test my blood sugar with the help of a blood sugar meter. So that's the very quick story of type 1 diabetes and what it's like to have it. Did I did I did I did I did I